dead silence. It, handling rides just like any bike. So I'm on eco mode, a little uncomfortable, you know, but that's a sport bike style. It's uncomfortable. The seat is not good at all. This is the SR version. I forgot the name of it, but it's their sport version and it's heavy. You can feel the uh, girth of it. I mean, it is a heavy beast, but I do like it. I do like the electric motorcycles. I am very tempted. If my riding involved just commuting to one location, this would be the bike to get. But I think the problem with the electric bikes, the reason they have not really taken off, oh, you know, there's Suzuki. The reason they haven't taken off is because they have such limited range. So I have 104 miles on this. And um, it's a very, like, if you ride aggressively, you'll disappear in a matter of minutes. I, I, not minutes. There we go. Look at that. Very cool. Switch the sport. Oh, come on. How do you switch the sport? <laughs> It is so awesome. So awesome. I love it, man. Can you imagine like going around corners? Oh, come on, speed up, guys. Fifty five miles an hour. Eh. How does it handle in a corner? You know, it's very smooth. It doesn't have it. Man, this thing is a ninja! It goes around corners fairly well. And I've already lost one range. There we go, 73 miles an hour, just like that. And the range went from 102 to 97, and now it's crawling back up to 98. So that's the problem, you know, seeing that mileage kind of disappear. But you know, I love the silence of bikes because when you have a silent bike, you can get away with a lot more stuff. And you know, when I was riding the Pan American through here, going obnoxiously loud, I was calling a lot of attention. And that's how cops figure out that you're speeding it's like the noise sometimes they don't go by the uh, look it's really just the noise all right I guess we turn oh no no I don't want to they should not put the mode button in the same way it works for the turn signals because it's very easy to make that mistake because it's right here Oh, you can't downshift. Oh, it's so dead silent. <laughs> you can hear all these bikes going. It's a fun bike, man. But I like this bike a lot. 96 miles. So it kind of computes back up to if I was to ride this the way I rode the Pan American, the, the range would go down quite a bit. So here we go, now I'm hitting the brake and you feel, you actually feel the bike slowing down quite a bit without, even without the braking. I mean, the regen is quite strong, like I'm actually not even braking. It's the regen working. Look at this, you can barely, you don't even have to use the brakes. What I found is that the people that get zeros, they're all in IT. They're all in IT. Like, it's a uh, kind of like nerd fest with the zero owners. You know, I'm not saying that they're uncool, you know. Nerds are actually the coolest people currently in the world. So they're getting these bikes a lot. Look at that, the regen is just so good. 
the regen is so good and this thing has got like a little bluetooth enabled thing the icons and stuff i think they need to modify them they're too standard it doesn't seem like you're going fast because the bike is silent but i think um the audio from bikes make you ride harder and more aggressive this thing all you hear is like a little jetsons style engine turbine thing happening and when that happens it doesn't seem like you're going very fast suspension is a little bouncy it's not very um, it, oh it went back to eco what the hell no wonder i had no power no no i was in mode what a minute i was in sport mode shit now I'm on Eco. Okay. Traction. Oh, that was traction, not sport. No, I'm not even in sport mode. I need to get on traction sport. All right, now this is the real sport mode. Before I was just in like traction. Okay. Oh! Fuck yeah, that was a big difference. That was a big difference. Oh my God, I was riding in eco mode. What a goddamn, I need to take another ride. Oh, now it's in sport mode. Man, sport mode is just so much more powerful. Come on, I'm gonna let him. Oh yeah. Oh my god! Sport mode is just so much faster! Oh my lord! Oh, I thought this bike was broken. <laughs> oh boy. I They have to change the way you switch to sport. Because there's traction control for sport mode and traction control for... And then mode for power. And unfortunately... It's very difficult to switch. I mean, you push mode once, push it twice. It doesn't do anything. Left, right, it's just so odd. God damn this thing. It definitely like kills the uh, battery doing this. But you feel that power, that is insane. That power is insane. Ride a little bit harder. <laughs> you drain that battery with these uh, little hot, hot starts, man. But it is so fast. It's unbelievably fast in sport mode. Oh, come on, guys. Take another loop. I really would like to... That is incredible how fast this bike is I mean this thing is just a beast I love how like it's so smooth limited range I just gained one more mile I think it just kind of computes it based on how you're riding but it is kind of cool seeing the range increase as you're riding because of the the regen see I'm like I'm not stopping it's just breaking by itself it's really incredible. Ninety three miles. Well, that's the zero, guys. I am very, very pleased with this. That's an amazing bike and it looks great. It's a great looking bike. There's some cheap things like the suspension is not great. It handles great, but it seems it's always going slow because it's quiet. But I like that. I like that idea quite a bit. <laughs> 